Right, so Ariana Grande is back with her first single in years called Yes And, the lead track from her upcoming new album Eternal Sunshine, her first new record since 2020's Positions. Now before I say if the song is any good or not, I will admit I love how she comes out swinging at her critics. You know, she rips the piss out of them from the very start of the music video with them saying things like I miss the old Ari. You know, the singer. Now that does show a certain self-awareness that no matter what she does, she won't please everyone. I do like that. But what about the song? Well, look, it's not very good at all, I'm gonna be honest with you. Sonically on the surface, this is an out-and-out pop track. You know, the usual boring drum machines and the standard enough mid-tempo beat you hear on every chart song these days. There's nothing new or exciting here at all. Vocally, her lyrics are buried in the sound mix and on multiple listens with headphones on, I'm still struggling to hear what Ariana is actually saying. Now some will say, who gives a shit? This is a song for the club, there's nothing really deep to dig into, lyrically. But even with that logic, Yes And is too slow to be a club classic, so it's kind of left in this weird middle ground. Ariana Grande is competing with legends of this genre like Taylor Swift, who nails it most of the time. She should be doing better than this, overall this is really really bland and very disappointing.